Okay, so what we're going to do is first of all explain how the three-way valve can be used as part of the RTA 88 kit. First of all, you'll ensure that the stopcock goes from the 6, the 9 and the 12 position when the stopcock is in this layout. All you're going to simply do is remove the end cap. You've then got the needle. As you can see, this is a safety butterfly needle. This is on a 30 centimetre um, tube. All we're going to do is remove the end cap and attach it straight to the stopcock. As you can see here, there is a lock and also a tube lock here. The next thing we do is we attach the syringe. Pick that up. So as you can see, in this configuration, the blood draw can come straight through the stopcock. All I'm going to do is remove the cap, place the needle in, and draw off. And it's at this point you will see when you remove it from the arm, all you're simply going to do is hold the wings, pull the tube, and lock the tube off. Therefore, you'll have no drips. You can then use the stop lock number two so you have no drips. At this point then, whilst the turnkey is in this configuration, remove the cap and place on the blood transfer unit. If you're using the standard file, you will just leave this end cap in place. Otherwise, if you're using the larger vacutainer, you can remove it and it will go straight inside. Once you're in this position then, all we're going to do is do a quarter turn to the right on the, the key to ensure then that the flow goes in this direction. We place on the vacutainer. The tube fills. And the second container goes on. This whole setup is then disposed of in medical waste.